Či nastúpajú predstavníci Sjedinených amerických državá. What can they do here? Claire de Lune, the music, the skating from the Haydenettes. Just breathtaking. That was a stunning performance. Wasn't that a masterpiece of choreography? I, especially, again, the, the build at the end of the program, the artistic yeah. element, the intersection, and it just felt beautifully choreographed and wonderfully executed. Yeah, I, th I thought right from the off, it, it was almost like you were watching a... Uh, a choreographed waterfall. It was beautiful, absolutely amazing. It was delicate and powerful all in the right places. There's such a difficult balance to get there. Well, they must have put themselves in the mix with that, you'd think. And there were no glaring mistakes there, were there? No, I think there were a couple of little touchdowns in the no-hold element at the beginning, maybe nerves getting the better better of them, but they, they sure settled in and, as you mentioned, no glaring errors. It really was a joy to watch them. The shapes that they made out on the ice. That's glorious. It was so patient also, which you have to be in yeah. order for this to really hit, and, and I, I think that it did everything that it needed to do. Yes, yeah, 
so much attention to detail all the way through the program. The levels, the artistry. Another element that I think stood out for me with them was their twizzle element. I thought the interaction between the skaters and the change of, of configuration, I thought it was beautiful. Okay, so they need 78.89 to go into the lead. Team Heidenetz, Ostvario E76,74 in his second place, they slot in behind the Canadians. But team uh, Heidenetz puts him in a great position for the free. Short program, 76.74. They are in the mix. And is currently in second place.